psychology professor, did Jesus appear to be a loony? No, of course not. And why would he lie? He's lying to do what? To get himself beaten, tortured, and killed? How many have heard the trilemma? Have you heard the trilemma? That Jesus was liar, lunatic, or Lord? Now, some have thrown another one in there, legend, but nobody really believes Jesus was a legend. Even great skeptics like Bart Ehrman, who teaches at UNC Chapel Hill, agrees. If there's anything true from history, Jesus existed. Okay, so we're throwing that one out. Is he liar, lunatic, or Lord? Well, let's look at it this way. There's only two possibilities with regard to Jesus being God. Either he is God or he isn't God. Does anyone see any other third possibility here? <laughs> no? That would be, this is just basic logic here, right? So obviously if he's God, he's Lord. But if he isn't God, he lied about it. He said he was, but he really wasn't. Or he thought he was God, but he really wasn't. He was a lunatic. Those are the three options you have. That's it. Now, which one of these three options makes the most sense? Yeah, I mean, he, if anybody, psychology professor, did Jesus appear to be a loony? No, of course not. No. And why would he lie? He's lying to do what? To get himself beaten, tortured, and killed? That doesn't make any sense. Jesus is Lord. And of course, he didn't just assert it. I think he proved it by his miracles. But here are some other things he said that go to show that he's not just a man. For example, probably his most direct claim to be God was before Abraham was born, I am. Jesus said, your sins are forgiven. I and the Father are one. He also said, all authority in heaven and earth has been given to me. Or, whoever ob obeys my word will never see death. I am the resurrection and the life. No one comes to the Father except through me. He also said, I am the light of the world. Whoever follows me will never walk in darkness. I am the bread of life. Can any of you prove me guilty of sin? None of us could say that, right? Just ask our wives. Forget that. And pray in my name. And, Father, glorify me with the glory I had, had with you before the world began. This is not the utterances of a good moral teacher. These are the utterances of someone who claims to be God.